Hi guys, Mike here. Uh, so today I wanted to walk you through the basics of flying an airplane. Um, the last video I did, I made uh, a pre-flight checklist. Uh, and so today we're going to uh, go through basically the, the basics of flying uh, a single engine aircraft like this. And uh, for our review today, we're gonna be using this airplane I'm sort of trying to do a 360 here um, if you haven't seen uh, the pre-flight video that I did you can use the link right there uh, and check that out uh, so let's just walk through first like the basic parts that control an airplane and I'll start up front here so here we have the prop right this spans and spans and spans and spans like a fan okay and what the prop does is give you power basically uh, and it's, you can see it's connected right to the engine which is in the cowl in here um, and then the, t the functions of the tires are basically for landing that's all it, that's basically all it serves uh, for landing and uh, you have I don't know, every time I'm trying to make a video, somebody comes in. Uh, that's my instructor there. So I've got maybe five, ten minutes to finish up this video. So let's jump in the airplane real quick and walk you through this. All right. So you've got all of this here. And then you've got the control stick. And last time I didn't show you, but if you can see there, those are your rudders. And these go in and out like that. You see, they're like pedals like it on a boat so uh these these are your control arms uh a control stick or joystick whatever you want to call them on other planes like the Cessnas you have the yoke yoke basically if you see them they have like two uh grips like this and then you know you pull in and out and these these basically control your turns when you're in flight and you can see the ailerons whenever you move them they go up when it go up and down like this, it's called a pitch. You can pitch up, pitch down. Um, I mean, pitch down, pitch up. Uh, and then when they go left to right, it's called banking. So you can bank left and bank right. And again, this basically helps you control the airplane in flight. Um, the rudders, the rudders are mainly, they're also used in flight, but for the most part, you're using them while you're on the ground. And the rudders are basically your steering wheel. Like when you're on the ground, that's what you use to turn right and to turn left. To turn right, you basically push down to the right. And to turn left, you push down to the left. And I'll show you also uh, in the back where the rudder is um, as part of the stabilizer. And here you have your trim. Your trim is, is kind of like a, it helps stabilize the plane. So say, for example, you're in flight and you want to maintain a certain altitude. Um, what you do is first you get the, the airplane uh, where you want it and then you trim it until the, the airplane is stable. Uh, this is very useful when you, you know, again, when you're on a straight path or when you make steep turns, uh, it basically helps you keep the uh, airplane stable. Now, these right here are what controls like the power and how fast, slow, whatever that you're going. Uh, this is your throttle. Just like on a car, you have your accelerator. Uh, or on a bike, you have your throttle. Uh, and this, you know, basically is, helps you increase power or decrease power uh, to whatever power level you want or how fast you want the airplane to go. This, you use this to control it. And then you have your prop here. Uh, I would say serves similar functions, um, and you're interrupting my video. Oh shit! Uh, this is Francis. You met him the last time too. How you doing? Uh, I'm good, man. Plane is ready. Just pre-flight it. Uh, yeah. Just cough a few, okay? All right, cool. Uh, so back back to this. So we have your throttle again. It serves like an accelerator um, for the airplane. And basically, you use this to control how fast or how slow that you're going. Your RPM, I mean, the prop here also sort of serves the same purpose. 
Um, it basically helps you spin the prop fast or slow to whatever uh, speed that you want it. And then your mixture. Your mixture is what helps you pump gas into the engine. And as you can see, everything you have on the right side, you also have, I mean on the left side, you also have on the right side. See on the right side there, you've, you've got your rudders and you've got the control stick. Uh, and here, I don't have the key to this airplane because I won't be flying it today. Uh, but you have basically your avionics and uh, usually on this screen at least the steam gauge that I that I fly you have your um, your engine instruments on the right side and then on this side you have your flight instruments I'm trying to see if I'm leaving it, uh, anything out uh, but I don't think I am but these are your basic uh, tools to fly this airplane you get on on the seat Make sure your legs are perfectly comfortable and good with the uh, with the location of the rudders. If they're too far out, you pull them in. You can pull them in by pulling this and cutting it loose and then setting it to whatever distance that you want it. Um, oh, and also one thing I, I did miss. See, these are your rudders, right? Whenever you push down, you use this. But to brake, these are the brakes up here. So if you want to stop this airplane while it's on the ground, you push down on this top part, and that will uh, uh, put the help you uh, come to a stop. And also, you can use this. This is this is also a brake, basically parking brake, just like you have the handbrake on a, uh, in a car. That's that right there for the airplane. Um, so yeah, um, to fly the airplane, you get in the seat. You know, go through your checklist, get the engine started. Uh, you use the rudders while you're on the ground okay to control left and right you basically while you're on the ground this is useless you, you don't use this at all um, and then when you're about to take off you put everything in full power and you pull this you pitch up basically slightly when you get I believe for this airplane is 60 knots when you get to 60 knots you pitch up and you know you get off the ground so I'm, I'm uh, on a different airplane now, uh, remember what I was saying earlier about the uh, the rudders? And this is the plane we're going to be flying, that I'll be flying tonight. Um, as you can see, this is a steam ga gauge uh, uh, cockpit here. But uh, remember what I said about the rudders. So this is what helps you turn up and down, left and right. So while you're in the air, this is called your aileron, and this is what helps you, when you bank right or left, this is what helps you turn the airplane, okay, this way. Like level up like that. And you use the rudders. This is your rudders right here, what I showed you inside the cabin, which you control with your foot. This is your rudders, and they go, they swing right, left, and they help you uh, turn again while you're on the ground and in flight and that will be it for today i will continue to try and get these videos up and uh talk to you guys later Bye.